thank you, Susan. Uh, she, she said it beautifully, uh, kind of get, skipping to the end. I think we are here in Pittsburgh in a position where we just might be poised to get it right. So uh, uh, that, that's a theme I hope to continue throughout, and I'm going to wrap up talking about just a couple of things we have going on, most particularly talking about the uh, national initiative to improve uh, uh, community trust and justice. The, re the reason I'm here, to, here today is I realized probably in the later seven or eight years of my career that uh, my organization was, was having a struggle by, and I was recognizing it wasn't just my organization, that our community, our uh, profession was in something of a crisis. Okay? We we're, were experiencing a crisis of legitimacy, experiencing a crisis of communication and relationships with some of the communities that, communities that we serve. I became painfully aware that the fault lines for, the, for this impending crisis were driven along lines of poverty, which all too commonly in this nation are drawn along lines of race. And I recognized that the policing institution, if it is to be uh, legitimately worthy of being called a profession, needed to look very carefully at what we do, how we do it, and needed to continue to advance along with society to be responsive to, the, to those changes.